Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on time. In simple terms, time is something which consists of a past, present and future. We can use a clock or watch to tell the time. A clock normally hangs on a wall. We wear a watch on our wrist. A wall clock similar to this one is found in many houses. These clocks come in all shapes and sizes. The gold item hanging down is called a pendulum. It swings from side to side and controls the time. Wrist watches similar to this one come in all shapes and sizes. They are very useful because we can look at them instantly. The price can range from a few dollars to many thousands. Seconds. Seconds represent a very small period of time and there are 60 seconds in a minute. Seconds are used in many areas in real life. Athletes who run the 100 meters and 200 meter races, for example, have their times shown in seconds. Minutes. A minute is made up of 60 seconds. A good swimmer is able to swim the 100 meters freestyle in about one minute. A world-class swimmer will cover this distance in just under 50 seconds. Hours. An hour is made up of 60 minutes. If you were to walk about six kilometers, it would take approximately one hour to finish. Two sets in a tennis match could take about an hour. Days. There are 24 hours in a day. The Earth takes 24 hours to make one full rotation around its axis. It is quite a long period of time when you consider that in one day you wake up, have breakfast and make your way to work or school. You may be retired so you can spend your daylight hours doing whatever you want. During the evenings you have dinner, watch TV and go to sleep. When you wake up, it all starts all over again. Weeks. There are seven days in one week. A week normally consists of five working days and two days which make up the weekend. Here we relax and do enjoyable activities with our family and friends. Years. A year consists of 52 weeks and it takes this long for the Earth to orbit the Sun. Birthdays are normally celebrated once every year. Decade. A decade is a period of 10 years. This description can be used for events which last for a long period of time or for a very long time. Example. The scientists took over a decade to make sure that the rocket was able to launch safely into space. Century. A century is a period of time lasting 100 years. Example, it has been just over a century since the beginning of the First World War. 